to put my presents under the tree. Bye. Hey, Grouchy, want to hear my solo? I hate solos. Easy Smurf said, watch out. Be careful, clumsy, slow down. Hefty, careful now, sloppy. Hey, Smurfs, want to hear my solo? Not now, Harley. <laughs> You should know better. Papa Smurf says the great pudding is one of the most important elements of the holiday celebration, and any distraction that might cause even one drop to be spilled. No Smurf appreciates good music anymore. <laughs> Wanna hear my solo, Lazy? Mm, Murphy looking presents you have there, Jokey. My special holiday surprises. One for every Smurf. Have you made yours? I wrote a holiday solo. Wanna hear it? Uh, well, I <laughs> That's not funny. I'll have to make another. I can hardly wait for it to be done. It's the greatest pudding I ever made. And I didn't spill a single drop. I know that Papa Smurf will be pleased with my work, and I, for one, predict that. You want to hear my solo now? Move it a little higher. Easy with those cones. A little lower, Smurfette. That's right. Perfect. Ah, all my little Smurfs look so happy. This may be the best holiday celebration we've ever had. And ever since then, on every Christmas Eve, Jolly Santa Claus with his white beard, bright red cap, and a big sack sets out on his journey to visit children all over the world. And bring us presents? Oh, I love that story, Grandfather. Is Santa Claus real, Grandfather? Well, when I was a little boy, William, Christmas Eve just wouldn't be Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve. Bah! Oh, I hate holidays, but Christmas I despise most of all. Just think of those miserable blue Smurfs out there, making their little presents, exuding all their yuck, love and good cheer. I won't have it. I won't. I won't. I won't. Why, <coughs> oh, oh, you miserable cat. I'm going to turn you into a rug that I can... What's this? Mother's old recipe for making life miserable. <coughs> This is it! This is just what I need to destroy this first Christmas! Oh, how they'll suffer! And after they've suffered long enough, I'll destroy them all! One by one! <laughs> jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way! Oh, what fun it is to ride in one! Uh, uh, not yet, Greedy! <laughs> I was just making sure it was ready, Papa Smurf. Oh, no, you weren't, Greedy Smurf. You were sneaking a bite for yourself, and that's very selfish and unsmurfy because... Rainy. There are 99 other Smurfs besides yourself, and... Rainy. We all want equal shares of the great pudding because... Rainy. Thank you. Now, as I was saying, Greedy, the great pudding isn't complete until we add the final ingredient. Uh, you, you mean the last walnut, Papa Smurf? That's right, the last walnut. Uh, you mean the big, uh, plump, ripe, uh, delicious one that, uh, you ate? Sorry, Papa Smurf. I couldn't resist. That's all right, Petey. <sighs> I'll borrow another walnut from Squirrel. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, oh what, what fun, fun it is to ride in one. Now, Azriel, this wonderful recipe isn't complete until we add the final ingredient. Dearest mother's own sweet touch, oil of rat wax. Oh, it does my heart good, Azriel. Soon the Smurfs will be no more. Ah! Uh, I don't understand what went wrong, Azriel. I followed mother's recipe right down to the last... Ah! <laughs> Get it, Smurf Squirrel. I have it. <laughs> I got it, Papa Smurf. Guess my eyes aren't as good as they used to be. Thank you, Squirrel, and happy holiday to you. Oh, 
us, Riel, to think Christmas is almost upon us. And those vile little smurfs are out there singing, dancing, and laughing. Ew, it's enough to make me throw up. If I could only get my hands on their rotten blue hides, I'd... Now what? Hello? Who are you? Please, kind sir. Our sleigh overturned and our grandfather won't open his eyes. Will you help us? Uh, do you have any money? No. Then go away. I'm busy. <laughs> He's mean. Yes, he is. Come, William. We'll find someone else to help us. My niece and nephew should have been here hours ago. Never should have allowed them to make the trip with their grandfather. Organize a search party immediately. Yes, sir. Grandfather's gone to heaven, Guinevere. He'll be all right, William. Just hope someone will help us. The nerve of those little brats, Asriel, interrupting me in my work. Now, let's see. Uh, where was I? Uh, ah, yes. Uh, two drops of bat spit. No, no, no. This recipe will never do. The Smurfs. There must be a way to destroy them. <laughs> Are you? Who I am is not important. What is important is that I can give you the power to destroy the Smurfs. And what in exchange? I want the two children who are lost in the forest. Uh, may I ask why? Revenge, a simple revenge. The children's uncle, the good bailiff, by the very nature of his goodness, constantly meddles in my affairs. He has stopped me from doing my deeds time and time again. Now, I will make him suffer by kidnapping the children. Of course, I would have picked them up myself, but alas, goodness comes my way only by betrayal. That's where you fit in. I see. And the Smurfs? This scroll will tell you how to find the Smurf village and what to do when you get there. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. I'll leave right away. Children first, Smurfs second. Uh, oh, yes, yes, yes. Of course, of course. I... <coughs> yoo Children! Now, where can those two brats be? yoo Children! Hello! We're looking for two lost children, my niece and nephew. Have you seen them? Uh, no, no, I haven't. There's been an accident. Their grandfather's sleigh overturned. He's all right, thank goodness, but we can't find the children. Oh, the poor dears. Oh, I shall certainly keep an eye out, sir. I'm offering a reward. Ten gold coins for their safe return. <laughs> Ten gold? <laughs> well, <laughs> that is generous. <laughs> but the main thing, of course, is that the dear children are safe. <laughs> oh, I do pray that they are well. Well, keep an eye open. I'm sure we'll find them. And a Merry Christmas to you, my good man. Oh, and, and, and a Merry Christmas to you all. <laughs> Ten gold coins, eh? Uh, perhaps, Asriel, there is a way to have it all. The Smurfs and the gold. <laughs> you children. Oh, I'm, I'm scared, Quinevere. Poor grandfather. He's all right, William. Everything is going to be all right. Oh! Papa Smurf. Now I say we should. Hey, wait for me. Holy incense of oh, Holy night. Stop! Stop! I say. No! 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 You must not harm these children. They are our friends. Do you understand? It's Santa Claus. I hope so. Good boy. Good boy. Now be on your way, my friends. Please. Our grandfather is hurt and needs help. Our sleigh overturned and... Where is your grandfather? He's with the sleigh. Is he? Grainy and clumsy? Find that sleigh. Yes, Papa Smurf. Smurfette, go back to the village. I need help with these children. Yes, Papa Smurf. Now, my children, don't you worry. Are you Santa Claus? <laughs> Santa Claus? Me? There it is! Come on! <laughs> Oh, sorry, help me. 
see your grandfather anywhere, Brainy? Half the Smurfly, not hefty, but there certainly have been a lot of humans about. Well, we might as well head back and report to Papa Smurf. Oh, hey, Hefty, Brainy! Uh, look at this! Uh, what's it say, Hefty? What it says is not the point, Clumsy. What it means is the real issue here. Oh, get on with it! Ahem. <clears throat> Guinevere and William, grandfather is all right. Stay with the sleigh. I will return. I love you, Uncle Edgar. The message is clearly not meant for us. Yes, here we are. Three small blue specks in a white wilderness. Hey, wait for me. The trick, Osriel, is to turn the children over to the stranger, destroy the Smurf village, and then lead the rescue party to the stranger and receive the reward. Oh, ho, ho, it's perfect, Osriel. A plan made in heaven. Yoo-hoo, children. Wait till Grandfather finds out we saw Santa Claus and all his helpers. All that delicious, wonderful pudding, and I haven't even had one little... Baby Smurf, don't be so selfish. It's holiday time. You're supposed to give, not receive. And since you're far away from home on this Christmas Eve, I would like you to have this little gift. Oh, thank you. That's very nice of you, Santa. Uh, what's a Santa? Oh, it's so beautiful. Thank you. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! I found the sleigh, Papa Smurf. There was a note. It was from your uncle, and he says your grandfather's all right, and... And he wants you both to stay with the sleigh because he'll be back. That is good news. Oh, Santa, I'm so happy. I can hardly wait to see Grandpa and my dear, sweet uncle. Do we get to finish opening our presents before we leave? Why, of course, William, all of them. I hate presents. Oh, have a heart, Grudgy. Have a heart. This, this is a little song we sing every holiday. It's very old and very true. Goodness makes the happiness go away. Goodness makes you happy every day. Happiness cannot start if there's goodness in your heart. Goodness makes the badness go away. Let's hear you sing it, children. Goodness makes the happiness go away. Now, Hefty, Brady, Smurfette, gather some wood. We're going to need a large signal fire. Gargamel! Let me go! Let me go! Oh, please! Put us down! Please, Santa, help us! Help us! Please. Quiet, you brats, or I'll feed you to my cat. Come along, Gabriel. We'll take care of the Smurfs later. Oh, Papa Smurf! What does that mean? Old Gargamel walks with the children. I don't know, Smurfette, but I'm sure he's up to no good. What shall we do, Papa Smurf? There's only one thing we can do, Brainy. Follow them. Please, let us go. What are you going to do with us? That's my little secret. <laughs> Gargamel! The children are mine now, as agreed. Oh, yes, yes, of course, of course, as agreed. Here, here, take them, take them. My word is as good as gold. Yes, I'm sure it is. That stranger, something about him. And now, as agreed, here is the means for destroying the Smurf village. <gasps> yes. All right, children, go with the nice gentleman. I'm sure he has a lovely Christmas present for both of you. Indeed I do. Now, come along. Oh, Papa Smurf, how can anyone be so mean? Well, I must be on my way. Oh, and a Merry Christmas to you, children! <laughs> what about our village? It will have to wait, Vanity. These two children come first. <laughs> I found you at last, Smurfs. Come out and meet your doom. Smurfs? Smurfs? Smurfs! They're gone, Azriel! Oh, but no matter. They'll be back. Oh, glorious night. I'll just start without them. <laughs> Evil forces, all that's foul, witches, brew, demons, howl. Come destroy the Smurfs, good cheer. Let not one survive this year. Oh, it worked. <laughs> oh, they'll be hungry and homeless, miserable. Now, to collect my ten pieces of gold. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Smurfs. <laughs>
They can't be far ahead, Papa Smurf. Well, let's keep our distance until we know what he's up to. Hello! Uh, I, I found the children. Uh, a stranger wearing a cape was spiriting the poor little dears off through the forest. Oh, no! I, I tried to rescue them. Oh, how I tried. And, and I, I, I nearly lost my life to that madman's anger. Which way did the scoundrel go? Is that way, uh, across the ice and through those trees. Let's go, men. Uh, wait. Uh, what about my reward? Uh, my ten pieces of gold? You shall have it when we find the children. Oh, well, this is disappointing. Quiet! Ah! Uh -huh. A contract is a contract, and you have broken ours. Me? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you, you misunderstood. You see, I was only... Silence! Now you will come with me. Oh, oh, oh yeah, well, I'd like to, but I, I, I have other business to it. Uh, I must see you. Uh, I, I have... <laughs> Oh, yes, 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 I know, I know. Anything you say, anything, just call them off, please. After you, Gargamel. Oh, yes, oh, yes, 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 yes. Look, Papa Smurf, Gargamel and Azriel have joined them. Oh, poor William. Poor Guinevere. Perhaps even poor Gargamel. Poor Gargamel. Uh, uh, I can't walk anymore, mister. Where are you taking us? This place will do nicely. Uh, then you won't be needing me, so I'll just... On the contrary. Someone as nasty as you is always of use to me in my work. Uh, but, 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 but... Therefore, you will accompany me and the children on what I regard as a final journey. You said no more walking. We won't be walking, my dear child. Uh, where are you taking us? Oh, my home. I'm quite sure you'll like it. No, 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 I won't go. No one leaves oh. until after the ceremony. Please, you're scaring me. Fire, fire burning bright. Take us home this very night. Oh, stop, please, stop. Oh, please, yes, stop it, please. I, I, I'll be good, I promise, I, I'll be good. Oh, Smurf is us. We're too late. Yes, too late. Perhaps not. Yes, perhaps not. But Papa Smurf, what can we possibly do against such evil power? There is one greater power, the power of love. You must sing, my little Smurfs. Sing? Yes. Sing as you've never sung before. Believe as you've never believed before. Goodness makes the badness go away. Goodness makes you happy every day. Louder! Badness cannot start if there's goodness in your heart. Goodness makes the badness go away. Santa, you're here! The Smurfs! Be gone, you little pests! Your tampering powers beyond your understanding. Help! Santa, help! Louder, my Smurfs! Put your heart into it! I warn you, Smurf! Stop your meddling! Goodness makes you happy every day. The fire cries up fire. Children, can you hear me? Yes! Then sing with us. You know the words. It's your only hope. Goodness oh? makes the badness go away. Goodness makes you happy every day. Goodness in your heart. Goodness makes the badness go away. We were so worried. Safe 
and sound. I made certain of that. Now, uh, about that reward. Don't give him anything. Oh? He was mean to us. Was he now? <laughs> Nonsense. <laughs> I, I, I was only trying to teach them the ways of the forest. <laughs> you know how children are. <laughs> Wait, don't hurt him, please. It's Christmas Eve. Time for forgiving. Even him? Even him. Uh, yes, well, <laughs> a, a time for forgiving. Uh, I quite agree. <laughs> uh, well, uh, I must be going. I tell you, Asriel, there is no justice in this world. Ow! None at all. Yeah. None at all. Santa Claus saved us. Santa Claus? Yes, and all his helpers. Oh, you'll never believe what happened. <laughs> Santa Claus? Well, my, my. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Santa. Merry Christmas. Christmas to you all, and thank you! Well, it's not much of a holiday, eh, little Smurfs? No presents, no pudding, no tree, not even warm beds. But we still have the most important thing, each other. Yeah, that's right. My word's exactly, Papa Smurf. I hate this, but I still feel good. Hey, any Smurf want to hear my solo? Sure! Yeah! Oh, yeah. Hit it! <laughs> oh, how beautiful! Oh, gosh, Papa Smurf, what happened? I, I'm not quite sure. Maybe anything can happen, even miracles. Yeah! You see, little one, at this time of year, we celebrate the spirit of giving. We celebrate by making music. That's funny. Everyone is off key but me. We celebrate by making goodies. Here, you two can help me pull this Smurf Berry Taffy. You pull, I'll supervise. All right now, Clumsy. Pull to the right, now to the left, up in the air, to the side, behind your back. No, 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 you're doing it all wrong. Here, let me. Oops. Papa Smurf. We celebrate by gathering mistletoe from the great oak tree. Here's another one. That's plenty handy. We kiss under the mistletoe. I hate kissing! And we use the mistletoe to decorate the village. That's not the only thing we'll be decorating, Papa Smurf. These red and green dinies will really put Baby in the holiday spirit. I've made enough to last Baby the rest of the year. <sighs> what a beautiful time of year. Seems like the whole world is filled with love and holiday cheer. <laughs> this year, jolly old Mr. Nicholas is going to bring us what we want, Azriel. It's about time he answered one of my letters. <clears throat> Dear Mr. Nicholas, I have been a good boy this year. For Christmas, I would like a Smurf. Uh, 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 since I've been extra good, make that six Smurfs. <laughs> Yours sincerely, Gargamel. Yeah. I know I write the same letter every year, Azriel, but someday he's bound to fall for it. One must be persistent. <laughs> Look at this. Every year I get a tiny package like this, and every year it explodes. Well, this year, I'm not going to fall for it. Yow! Oh, ouch, 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 you... Ooh, ooh. Drat those Smurfs! Please, Mr. Nicholas, please bring me Smurfs this year. Please, Mr. Nicholas, please! Please! 
please. Mr. Nicholas, Mr. Nicholas, I'm sick to death of hearing about this man. Every wretched Christmas he spreads the spirit of giving all over the kingdom. And giving is an act of love. Oh, how I hate love! Well, Mr. Nicholas, this Christmas I have a special present for you. The kiss of hate! Deck the halls with boughs of holly, fa la 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 la. Tis the season to be jolly, fa la 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 la. My my my! Oh, every year my list of children gets longer and longer. This year, twice the toys to deliver on Christmas Eve. Ah, well, <laughs> twice the smiles on Christmas morning. Well, what have we here? A little puppy. You must be cold and hungry. Now, don't you worry about a thing, little one. Now, don't you worry about a thing, Mother. I'll take good care of you. Oh, Eric, I wish you could have a nice Christmas like your friends, with a fine Christmas dinner and all the trimmings. Alas, all we have is a little bread. We have each other, and that's all that matters. You just get some sleep now. Dear Mr. Nicholas, how have you been? I have been a pretty good boy this year. I do not need anything for myself this Christmas. But please make my mother get well. Love, Eric Norton. <laughs> oh, Mr. Nicholas, do I have a gift for you? Look there! <gasps> it's Glorhydrus! Whoa! Whoa! A bear! Mistletoe! Yes, milady. Oh, I don't need much. Just a little mistletoe is enough for a kiss. After all, Mr. Nicholas would be the last one to break a Christmas tradition. <laughs> Will this do, milady? Splendid. What would Chlorhydra's want with mistletoe? It is a symbol of love, the thing she hates most. The Shavu. She is planning something evil. Come, we must investigate. I hate investigating. Drive on, Reeves. <laughs> Another batch of letters from the children. Oh, it's too bad I don't have a bunch of little elves to help me. <laughs> Dear Mr. Nicholas, I have been a good boy this year. For Christmas, I would like a smurf. <laughs> this Gargamel, every year he asks for a smurf, and I haven't the vaguest idea what he's talking about. <laughs> a strange little boy, very strange indeed. Good evening, good woman, and Merry Christmas to you. I am your new neighbor, and I've come to bring you holiday cheer. Well, the more cheer, the merrier, I always say. <laughs> Who is that, Papa Smurf? That's Mr. Nicholas, the man that makes presents for the children every Christmas. But why would Chlorhydrus pay him the visit? Merry Christmas to you! And Merry Christmas to... Christmas? Who cares about Christmas? <laughs> out, out! From now on, beg somewhere else! It worked! <laughs> the kiss of hate worked! <laughs> what? Ow! Take me home, Reeves! And make haste! Yeah! There will be no presents for the children this year. Or any year! <laughs> Oh, I'll fry a few and pickle a few and serve a few real cold. Then I'll toast a few and roast a few and boil six months for gold. Oh, Azriel, I've decided that Christmas is my favorite time of year. Because this Christmas, I'm sure to get six Smurfs. Oh, I'll fry a few and pickle a few and serve a few real cold. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Be gone, you sniveling pests! Worthless little brats! 
Oh, I'll fry a few and pickle a few and serve a few real cold. No, 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 no. Hmm. When a piece of mistletoe shrivels up and burns, it means a kiss has been used for evil. You mean Chlorhydrus put a spell on Mr. Nicholas? I'm afraid so, Handy. Oh, this poor little puppy. How could Mr. Nicholas be so cruel? Because, Smurfette, Chlorhydra's spell has apparently taken away his love. He was such a nice man. Can't you give him back his love, Papa Smurf? No, Taylor, I cannot. Love must come from within. It must come from within his own heart. <laughs> Oh, I think I'll sleep through Christmas and forget the whole business. Liver pate! Who will finish the toys? And who will deliver them? Well, my little Smurfs, would you be willing to give up your holiday to complete Mr. Nicholas' work? We, we sure, sure will! We won't let that mean Chlorhydra spoil anybody's Christmas! But work quietly, so we do not awaken Mr. Nicholas. We'll help poor Mr. Nicholas and bring the children cheer. And all the extra Smurfy things they love this time of year. Tommy would like a rocking horse. Frederick would like a drum, of course. Kitty would like a doll that talks. Billy would like a check in the box. What fun to work, because we know we'll bring the children joy. Happy faces will appear on every girl and boy. What fun to work because we know we'll bring the children joy. And happy faces will appear on every girl and boy. Grouchy! Happy faces! I told you to find happy faces! I hate happy faces! Well, my little Smurfs, we've made a gift for every child who wrote a letter to Mr. Nicholas. Sure. Oh, yeah. That was really close. We answered every single letter. I just need a little more wrapping paper. Maybe I'll smurf some of this closet. Papa Smurf! Well, my little Smurfs, it looks as though our work isn't finished yet. What is going on in here? Who are you, little imps? And what are you doing in my house? <laughs> And what are you doing here? L let's Smurf out of here, Papa Smurf. Don't be afraid. Mr. Nicholas is a good man who happens to be under an evil spell. I am not under any spell. And you still have not explained your presence here. We are Smurfs, and we are here to help you finish your work and see that your Christmas gifts are delivered. Bah! I wash my hands of this giving nonsense. But if you want to waste your time, go ahead. Quickly, Smurfs, we have no time to lose. We'll need another toy fire engine, and four more rag dolls, six teddy bears, and some building blocks. Amazing. I never thought we'd finish. This is the last one, Papa Smurf. Thank you, baby Smurf. <laughs> Climb aboard, Smurfs. We're all ready to go. We did it. We Smurfed presents for all the children. Yeah! All right, big dear. Giddy up. Please, my friends, make haste. We're in a great hurry. Oh, Papa Smurf, the reindeer won't move. I hate not moving. Possibly Chlorhydra's keys to them as well. No, they are just well trained. They will not move without their master. I'm afraid Chlorhydra's plan has succeeded. There is no way we can deliver these gifts. <laughs> Better put out the candle, Eric. It's the last we have. Yes, Mother. Sleep well. I just know you'll feel better in the morning. After all, tomorrow is Christmas. Yes, but we don't even have enough money to buy a candle, let alone a Christmas dinner. I tell you, Azriel, this will be the best Christmas dinner we've ever had. Smurfs in cranberry sauce, with plum stuffing, ginger smurf cookies, and smurf pie. Mmm! 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 And of course,
course, I'll have to make a big bowl of Christmas Smurf punch. It's the punch part I like best. <laughs> but it will only happen if Mr. Nicholas fills my Christmas stockings with Smurfs. We'd better get to sleep so the old fool can sneak in here and make my Christmas wish come true. Uh -huh. After all, I have been a kind and generous person all year. I deserve a reward. Just one thing left to do. I say a holiday is what you make of it. And I made this holiday just the way I like it. No comfort, no joy, no spirit of giving. <laughs> all in all, this is going to be the merriest Christmas I ever had. <laughs> Why did I ever get involved with giving presents to children? <laughs> I thought I told you all to leave. Mr. Nicholas, your reindeer will not make the trip without you. That's your problem now. Now, see here, Mr. Nicholas. You started this whole tradition of holiday giving. It's up to you to keep it going. Well, I'm not going anywhere. And that means my reindeer aren't going anywhere. And that means those presents aren't going anywhere. Oh, Bob and Smurf, isn't there any way to break that mean, nasty spell? Perhaps if we could help him remember how he used to feel. Well, who let you back in my house? What's this? Another stupid letter? Oh, dear Mr. Nicholas, I do not need anything for myself for Christmas. But please make my mother get well. Love, Eric Norton. The poorest boy in town, yet all he asks is that his mother be well. A heart full of joy can put strength into the frailest of bodies. Especially the kind of joy you bring, Mr. Nicholas. You just can't give up. But I just don't feel the way I used to. <laughs> oh, but, hey, uh, get off my beard. <laughs> hey, you better come out of there. <laughs> Stop that. Oh, <laughs> it tickles. <laughs> Why am I? I feel a bit dizzy. You do? Good. The natural love that dwells in your heart has been revived with Eric's letter and Baby Smurf's kiss. Yay! Ah, oh, I do feel as if a great weight has been lifted from my heart. Ah, <sighs> hello there, little puppy. Have you met Baby Smurf? <laughs> Oh, my goodness! My deliveries! Yes, Papa Smurf, they are a fine team of reindeer, but they'll never be able to reach all the homes in the village by Christmas morning. There just isn't time. Your reindeer seem anxious to try to make the trip, Mr. Nicholas. Oui, oui, they seem most eager. Well, I suppose we could try. <gasps> Amazing! The reindeer! Flying reindeer, it's a miracle! Then let's get smurfing! Fly away, my friends! Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! Huh? What's that? Gee, Mr. Nicholas and his reindeer are flying! And it looks like he has little blue elves helping him! <gasps> They're gone! Flying reindeer and little blue elves? Oh, I must be dreaming. Mother! Mother! Mr. Nicholas left us a Christmas tree! A and a Christmas dinner! <laughs> and a puppy! Oh, my, my! Mr. Nicholas outdid himself this year. I don't know how he does it. Mother! You shouldn't be out of bed. But I feel much stronger, son. 
<laughs> In fact, I'm so happy I feel healthy again. Oh, Mother, this is the best Christmas ever. <laughs> oh, this is going to be the best Christmas ever. Because it will be the worst Christmas ever. <laughs> oh. There's a little boy with a sick mother living in that house. Oh, I can't pass this up. Freeze! Stop here! Whoa! Whoa! I'm sure the little twit has been crying his eyes out ever since he woke up this morning and found nothing in his Christmas stocking but Lent. <laughs> oh, how I love <laughs> huh? Curses! Somehow Mr. Nicholas must have broken my spell. I'll get that jolly old geezer yet. Oh, my name isn't Chlorhydris. Home, Reeves! Quickly! <laughs> Not without me, you stupid, dim-witted idiot! I wonder how many Smurfs Mr. Nicholas has left me, huh? Nothing, Matriel. The stupid fool left me nothing again this year. Nothing, nothing, not... Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's something in this one. <laughs> My letter didn't fool Mr. Nicholas one bit. Well, I guess there's only one thing I can do, and that is be good until next Christmas. Good? What am I saying? Yo! Merry Christmas indeed. <laughs> understand it myself, Andy. It is something which will forever remain <laughs> a great mystery. Oh, uh, sure, Briny. Oh, my foot. Oh, I need my snowflower pollen to reduce the swelling. Oh, but it's back in my lab. Don't worry, Papa Smurf. I'll get it for you. Clumsy, this was all your fault, so you better get that snowflower pollen right away or Papa Smurf may never forgive you. Oh, golly! Oh, here I come, Papa Smurf, as fast as I... I'll take it from here, Clumsy. Huh? I've got it, Papa Smurf! Uh, but, Brainy, that's no fair, I... <laughs> Whoa! Papa Smurf, I'll get you plenty more snowflower pollen. <sighs> but there's only one snowflower in the entire world, and it only blooms once a year. In fact, it should be blooming now. Just tell me where it is and I'll go get it. I'm glad you feel that way, Brainy, because the snowflower I need grows at the top of Ice Mountain. Ice, Ice Mountain! Mountain. Now remember, Smurfs, 
you mustn't pick the snow flower. Just bring back the pollen. That way, the flower can continue to bloom each year. Right, Papa Smurf. Forward, ho! Goodbye. Bye-bye. Bon voyage! Your bravery will not be for... Oops! Hefty, I'm thirsty, and, uh, and, uh, I, I, I forgot to go to the bathroom. And, um, I didn't make my bed. So can I go back? Will you relax, Granny? There's nothing to worry about! Nothing at all! a funny feeling we're being watched. Watched? <laughs> oh, come on, Smurfette. All of a sudden, this place has given me the creeps, too. Well, let's just find that snowflower pollen and get out of here. Oh, look. There it is. Isn't it beautiful? Last one to the snowflower is a frozen Smurf. Yeah. <laughs> hey, where'd this big hole come from? I don't know. And I don't think we want to find out. Oh, let's just get that pollen and head for home. Okay, easy there. Careful. I can't go any higher. I'm the lightest Smurf here. Try lifting me up. This is risky, Smurfette. Maybe you better not. No, no, I'm fine. <laughs> Sorry, Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf, look! Smurf smoke signals from Ice Mountain. My Smurfs need me. Quickly, bring a sled. Please, put me down. Please! <coughs> please, please don't keep me here. I just want to go back to my friends. <coughs> <laughs> Look, I don't belong to you, and I don't belong here. Now let me go. <laughs> oh, don't cry. I, I appreciate your gift. It's just that I'm breathing <laughs> in here. <laughs> Thank you, but, but, but I'm starving too. <laughs> oh, but I need more than just an icicle. Hmm. <laughs> Really mad. And we're really cornered. 
Our only hope is to make a stand. Come on, Smurfs. Let him have it. Go away. Good work, Smurfs. We're almost there. Stop. This is the place where the snow flower used to grow, but it's gone. And so are the other Smurfs. From the look of things, there was a snow slide here, and all our dear little Smurfs were swept away. Poor Greedy. We've heard his stomach growl for the last time. And Clumsy will never be able to drop a log on my good foot. <laughs> 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 Smurfs! They're alive! Smurfs! Smurfs! Papa Smurf! Oh, are we glad to see you! Here, we got the snow flower for you! Excellent! Now, let's follow that beast to Smurfette. I'll treat my foot on the way. of the Smurf village. Like the snowflower, there is only one Smurfette in all the world. And now, the snowflower is no more. Remember, take only what we need. Thank you for sharing your snowflowers with us. And may we return next year when they bloom again. <laughs> that means we'll see each other every year, too. <laughs> Today, we honor those beloved Smurfs who risked their lives seeking the snowflower. We're so glad you're home. And I thought you'd be dead. Nope, I'm just out of food. Have some more cake? More sarsaparilla? Mm, I don't mind if I do. Got a surprise for you, Papa Smurf. Yes, in spite of everything, it's good to have things back to normal. <laughs> what a gorgeous morning! Out 
them. <clears throat> How I love this time of year, colors smurfy, winter near. Sky so blue and crystal clear, as leaves turn brown, I shed a tear. I hate poets. Good morning, Sloppy. Morning, Papa Smurf. Good boy. That's a smart fly you got there, Sloppy. Oh, thanks, Papa Smurf. He even shakes hands. Want to try? Uh, no, thank you, Sloppy. Another time. Sit up, fly. Here you fly. There a roll, fly. I smell snow in the air, and Cracker Smurf's nose is never wrong. <laughs> Yes, Chippy. It looks like a bad one. I'd better warn the others. Ta! Say, Hefty. Can't talk now, Tucker. We're gonna play ball! <laughs> oh, boy! What a smurfy day for a picnic! Greedy, lazy, wait a moment. Can't now, Tracker. <laughs> Painter, there's a big storm that... Ah, Tracker, the perfect day for painting the autumn leaves. Leaves? A terrible blizzard is coming. What's that about a blizzard, Tracker? Uh, Papa Smurf, my nose never fails, and I smurf a blizzard coming our way. Hmm. Well, you may be right. I'd better consult my almanac. Hello, Taylor. Could you smurf me up a nice coat with these scraps of fur? These? These are my ugly coat. Oh, no matter. I'm preparing for the blizzard. Blizzard? Are you crazy? I'll pick it up tonight. Da! A blizzard, he says. I tell you, this village is full of nuts. In the year of Southern Smurf? Hmm. Tracker is right. There will be an early snowfall. <laughs> Smurfs. Papa Smurf says that winter will arrive early this year and that we must start preparing immediately. Furthermore... Well, it sure doesn't look like winter to me. I hate winter chores. It's too hot for work. Let's go for a swim. Hey, good idea. We can smurf this con later. But Papa Smurf says we must smurf our winter chores, and... Does that look like a winter sky to you, Brainy? Actually, now that you mention it, no. It's kind of an azure sky with a few high clouds. A bright sun that... Hey, wait for me! La, 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 la. Oh, I'm so hot. Smurfs, we've got to get ready for the blizzard. Oh, Tractor. <laughs> Where did you get that dumb fur coat? What is that, Tracker? A fleet farm? <laughs> 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 Laugh if you wish, fellow Smurfs, but tomorrow it shall snow. Tracker was right. Winter is early. I hope all my little Smurfs have prepared. <laughs> oh, my brilliant mind is freezing. I hate the freezing. Gee, this much snow is scary. Onward! Ah! Hello, ho and all that rubbish. Did some Smurf say rubbish? <laughs> onward, onward! Jolly good morning, fellow Smurfs. I hate skiers. Oh, boy, I should sure hope Andy's home so I can smurf some more firewood. Yo, it's my fellow. Oh, that tracker makes me mad. Oh, Papa Smurf, which is so cold. No, no, freezing ging ging is more like it. I don't suppose anyone would be interested in an ode to cold. Heavens to Smurf the Troid. I'm so cold, I'm turning blue. But you are blue, Vanity. Oh. Isn't the winter store of firewood keeping you all warm? Well, uh, we ran out, Papa Smurf. Ran out? Oh, 
all the winter chores have been done, haven't they, my little Smurfs? Well, uh, no, Papa Smurf. Well, we didn't finish them. I overslept. It was uh, such a sunny day. We went on a picnic. Yeah, I know. Silence! Come in, come in. I want to know how many chores were done. Thank you, Jokey. Oh, dear. Hey, come back with my coat. <laughs> Th that's not funny, Jokey. <laughs> Hello, Scary. Have you seen Jokey? Uh-uh. Sorry. Because Papa Smurf says. Oh, no, you don't, Brainy. Let go, Hefty. I saw it first. I would look fantastic in it. Smurf a fresh supply from the forest, like I asked? Uh, uh, uh me, Papa Smurf? <coughs> I was busy, so I asked Lazy to do it. And I was busy sleeping, so I asked Hefty. That was your job, not mine! <laughs> Silence! Now, because of your carelessness, we're all liable to catch Smurfmonia, unless we get some more Smurf root. Hello. Tracker, we need your help. The Smurfs are all sick, and I'm out of Smurf room. Why, I'd be delighted, Papa Smurf. Except that certain unsmurfable Smurfs have ruined my coat. Hmm. Well, you'll need it to go out in this cold. <laughs> Smurf? Smurf? But, Papa Smurf, I'm already cold. It isn't fair, and you always said that... Quiet, Brainy! Oh, no! Now my toes will freeze. So what are you waiting for? Max. <laughs> this is a good coat you made, Taylor. So what do you expect? I know my business. They're all counting on you to find more Smurf root, Tracker. Every Smurf has Smurfmonia now, except you and... <laughs> Me. Not to worry, Papa Smurf. I shan't fail. Smurfroot. Smurfroot, I know you're about. Aha! We, we must find food soon, Azriel. Aha! Watch this. Hmm. Methinks we're on the trail of something succulent, Azriel. Aha! Smurfroot mission accomplished. Hello. Uh, goodbye. Get him, Asri. I'll get him. <laughs> ah, I see him, Asriel. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'll get him, Asriel. He's got you, you wretched little smurf. <laughs> my, my. He's a feisty little fellow, but he's hardly a match for. <laughs> Adio, Gargamel. Have a good day. <laughs> That's the last of our wood. I hope Tracker returns soon or we won't need any tea. I have something we can burn, Papa Smurf. It's my most...
most favorite garbage. Well, uh, thank you, uh, Sloppy, but uh, wood chips, bark, twigs, leaves, dust, dirt, fish bones, and a few old ratchets and widgets and you guys. <laughs> Thoughtful, Sloppy. Uh, thank you. You're welcome, Papa Smurf. Tally ho and all that rot. Did some Smurf say rot? Hello, here's the Smurf fruit. <laughs> yeah! It's going to be a hot one today, fellow Smurfs. Mr. Nicholas, uh, I'm still on my feet. <laughs> uh, but not for long. Well, at least all the toys are made, but they still need to be wrapped. Uh, what are we going to do? Hmm. The Smurfs helped me once. Perhaps they can again. There's not a moment to lose. Come on, Smurfs! Oh, yeah. Come on, let's hurry up, you know. Oh, dear. There goes Grouchy's last chance to join in the preparations. Why don't you give up on him, Smurfette? He's nothing but a lost cause. Yow! Grouchy! So that's where you've been hiding. How are you ever going to get into the holiday spirit if you won't... Great Smurfs! Do you see what I see? Reindeer. It must be for Mr. Nicholas. Ooh. Ah. Look, there's 
a note. Oh, my smurfness. What? What? Mr. Nicholas is in urgent need of our help. The reindeer will fly us back to him. Hurry, my little smurfs. Oh, yeah, come on, let's hurry. 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 Well, Grouchy, looks like you get another chance to participate after all. I hate after all. Oh, just look at all the happy people. Singing carols, baking Christmas goodies, decorating trees. Oh, there's only one thing I hate more than Christmas Eve. What's the matter, Signora? Christmas Day, you don't. That's when everyone opens their presents from Mr. Nicholas. That's right. <laughs> if only I knew where Mr. Nicholas lived, I'd stop him from delivering his gifts. Great gutter snipes, can it be? What's the matter? My chance to ruin Christmas. Hurry, my pet. <laughs> Hold on tight, my little Smurfs. We're about to make a turn. <laughs> you think you're doing? I'm getting my stocking ready for Mr. Nicholas. This year I've asked for lots and lots of gifts. You've got to be kidding. I've written to that goody-goody for years, and he's never left me one thing, not even an itsy-bitsy smurf. Well, I'm sure Mr. Nicholas will bring me everything I've asked for, especially when he reads about what a good little boy I've been this year. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. The only way to get what you want in this world is to reach out and take it. And that's just what I'm going to do with those wretched Smurfs. Ta -da! Well, what do you think of my latest disguise? And he calls me ridiculous. That's it, elves. Drink up. My herbal soap should put the green back in your cheeks. A few days rest and you'll feel like a new elf. Uh, but what about the toys? Don't worry. The Smurfs are taking care of everything. What are my little Smurfs doing? Ho, ho, ho! Exceedingly well, Papa Smurf. You can always count on us, Mr. Nicholas. Well, almost all of us. Oh, Grouchy, aren't you gonna do anything? Just think of the children on Christmas morning. It could help by staying out of our way. Hm, I hate out of our way. Monsieur Nicholas, we are almost finished. What next? We must fill my sack with all the toys. All the toys in one sack? <laughs> you must be smurfing our leg. Ho, ho, ho! This is a magical sack, my friend. Just start filling it and you will see. Well, if you say so. <sighs> it, my friends. See? It's bottomless. No matter how many toys you put in, there's always room for more. There it is, my pet. The house of Mr. Nichols. Yeah. <laughs> Those little blue dumplings should be easy to spot in all this snow. Timber! Good work, Timber. Yeah, this tree is really smurfy. I'm sure gonna be seeing it in the forest. Hey, look, a snowman. Oh. Gosh, he sure is awful wrinkled. I wonder why he has that sack. Allow me to demonstrate, you little blue bean brains. <laughs> Go to <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a wonderfully wicked Christmas this is turning out to be! And it's light as a feather, see? Oh, no wonder 
You can deliver so many gifts in one night. Well, now I can, thanks to you Smurfs. Hey, everyone! Why don't we celebrate with a Smurfy mug of my hot soup? Good idea! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> my Smurfness! Where's Grouchy? There you are! Aren't you going to join us? Uh, where's your holiday spirit? Smurfette, Smurfette, Smurfette. Don't you see he has none? Yeah, why waste your time? Come on! Grouchy is Apsa Smurfly Hopeless. I hate Apsa Smurfly Hopeless. Yeah! <laughs> No, we'll see how happy Christmas will be without Mr. Nicholas' sack of toys. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! This soup is quite delicious, Greedy. Perhaps I should bring a jar of it with me when I make my Christmas deliveries. Hey, Smurfette, where are you going? To see Grouchy. Made me some hot soup to warm his spirits. You couldn't warm his spirits with a torch. Now, Brainy. Ah! Great Smurfs, what's wrong? Oh, I'm Smurf! Look, the toys, they're gone, and so is Grouchy. Mmm, a little blue plum pudding would hit the spot right now. Yeah! Yeah! No! No! Stop! Huh? Whoa! Whoa! Ah! 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 Ugh, what fool is walking in the middle of it? Ugh, it's Gargamel. I might have known. That's right, you roadhog. Why don't you watch where you're going? And why don't you stay out of my way, you blundering idiot? I'm in such a good mood, Clawhydris. I'm going to pretend I didn't even hear that. Just don't cross me again, you dunderhead. That's a telling him. No doubt about it, Papa Smurf. Somebody was here, all right. Oh, dear, if I don't get my sack back before nightfall, there won't be any Christmas. I suggest you prepare your sleigh and reindeer at once, Mr. Nicholas. We must follow these tracks. Good idea, Papa Smurf. But what about Grouchy? I'm sure that once we find our missing sack, we'll also find our missing Smurf. Boy, I can't wait. When Mr. Nicholas delivers my toys, I'll finally get rid of all this old junk. Hey, maybe you'd like this stuff. Oh, I'm evil, medieval. <laughs> I'm back. Don't tell me you actually caught some Smurfs. <laughs> Just feast your eyes on this! What? Oh, wow! Wait, 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 where are my Smurfs? Here, let me! Huh? Toys! 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 <laughs> hey! There's more! Enough already! Gee, Gorgie, I, I don't know what to say. What are you talking about? Well, you got these for me, didn't you? Obviously, this weather has frozen your brain. Hmm, what's this? Merry Christmas from Mr. Nicholas? Gee, these must be his toys. Of course. Clohydris must have stolen them. And then we must have switched sacks by accident. <laughs> well, the toys are mine now. All mine. Don't be ridiculous. You've got to put them all back so I can exchange sacks with her again. Now start stuffing while I dress. B -b -b but You heard me. Put them back now. We'll see about that. Gotta work fast. Let's see. What do I fill it with? Ha-ha! 
careful with those toys, you twit. Sure, Gargi. Sorry. Now you think it's full of toys. <laughs> there. That's more like it. E cats, you're finished already. See for yourself. That was awfully fast. <laughs> Good work, Scruple. Maybe I'll buy you a little toy after I've turned the Smurfs into gold. Gee, Gorgi, you're too generous. Yippee! Now they're really mine. All I have to do is find a good place to hide them. <laughs> the coast is clear. Come on, Asriel, let's hurry. <laughs> what a great Christmas this is turning out to be. Oh, Grouchy, aren't you going to do anything? Just think of the children on Christmas morning. Grouchy is absolutely hopeless. I hate absolutely hopeless. The tracks are getting difficult to see, Papa Smurf. Perhaps we better follow them on the ground. If we lose those tracks, we lose the toys. And not if we find Grouchy. I'm sure he knows who took the sack. If we have to depend on that, Smurf, we might as well kiss Christmas goodbye. Hang on, my little friends. Down we go. <laughs> oh, what a glorious conflagration this is going to be. <laughs> Guys, Timber, what's going on? Looks like she's gonna start a fire. This is a momentous occasion, my pet. The day that Christmas cheer goes up in smoke. Ah! <laughs> uh, guys, does anyone smell smoke? Uh oh, Smurfs, get ready to jump! What? Uh, gosh, where are we going? Who knows? Just keep jumping. Come back here. Uh, keep going. Uh, we Smurfs. You what? We switch sacks, you idiot. Thanks to you, you bungling boob. <laughs> Your Christmas Eve reprieve is over, you miserable Smurfs! These are the toys. Every last one. Why children look forward to getting this junk every year is beyond me. Why do you want the toys anyway? <laughs> Just watch. Goodbye, Christmas! <laughs> he yells. She's as mean as I am. Oh, gosh, maybe meaner. Ah, uh, you won't think so once I get you back to my place. All right, Gargamel. You've got your Smurfs. Now let me show you to the door. Huh? <laughs> Those aren't the toys. What do you think you're trying to do? <laughs> but they must be the toys. <laughs> Unless... Suddenly, I smell a 60-pound rat. Ho-ho! Oh, this'll be a perfect hiding spot, Asriel. <coughs> Come on, we better be getting back. I got all day tomorrow to play with my ill-gotten gifts. <laughs> I hate ill-gotten gifts. I hate... You know, Asriel, when I think about all those poor kids expecting gifts tomorrow, it kind of makes me want to, uh, laugh. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! I'm sure that Scruple has the real sack. He must. He better, or you're going to end up with a smurfless Christmas. Look, there's the two-timing twerp. Uh-oh! <laughs> Where's the 
a sec. I'll never tell. They're my toys. Mine. Wow! A smurf. A sack. My toys. It's no use. The snow has covered the tracks completely. <sighs> this will be the first Christmas I've ever missed. I'm so sorry, Mr. Nicholas. Help! Help! Great Smurfs! Quick, to the sleigh! Ah! Uh, yeah! Nicholas. Oh, Grouchy, you did it! You saved Christmas! Yeah! Yeah! Oh! oh, no! Oh, oh! Ah! Oh! Help! 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 Chlorhydrins! Thank goodness you still have the Smurfs! That's right, you bad luck buffoon! <laughs> e Gats, what are you doing? Let's get out of here! Great heavens! My little Smurfs! Quick, we must turn back! Ooh, Clohibis! I'll get you for this, you! You backstabbing battle axe! Happy holidays, Gargamel! No, wait! Come back! Come back! Some Christmas this is turning out to be! And so, because of Mr. Nicholas's late start, I've decided that we should all help deliver the toys. Climb aboard, my little Smurfs! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, how can I ever thank you all? Grouchy deserves the most thanks. Yeah! And all along, we thought he had no Christmas spirit. Not all of us, Hefty. I, Brainy Smurf, for one, always suspected that behind Grouchy's gruff exterior, Smurfed a heart of... Oh! <laughs> I think we're ready. Hold on, my friends. Oh, when I think about how happy the children will be when they open their gifts, I can't help but smile. I hate but to smile, but I can't help it either. Ho, 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 ho! Merry 